One question I'd like to share that we meet people we meant to meet, or is it a destiny, luck or fate? Have you just fallen in love with something? <laughs> huh? <laughs> no, no, because I don't want to disturb the romance. <laughs> See, look at it this way. Since you woke up today morning, till this moment, let's leave the sleeping time. Since you came awake fully, from that moment to this moment, your body has been doing its things, isn't it so? Physical activity is happening, both outwardly and inwardly, happening or no? That's why we're alive, it's happening. Mental activity has been happening, emotional activity is happening, energy activity is happening. How much of these four dimensions of activity did you perform consciously from the moment you came awake till now? How much do you think? What percentage? What percentage? Well below one percent, believe me. When you perform activity consciously less than one percent, over ninety-nine percent is unconscious. Everything will look accidental, isn't it? Hmm? Everything looks like divine intervention because ninety-nine percent of the time you're unconscious. Do one thing, when you drive today to wherever you drive, ninety-nine percent of the time close your eyes and drive. You will see how many people you will meet. But if you drive with your eyes open, fully conscious, you're not going to meet anybody like with this with the bank. Hmm? Things will happen in a completely different way. How conscious we are will determine how much of your destiny you determine. How unconscious you are determines how much of your destiny is accidental. Everything that's accidental, we want to attribute it to some other force elsewhere. Now this must stop. We must understand, it is we. Is there no other force? Of course, you didn't make the creation nor did I, all right? You did not create this creation nor did I create this creation, there is. But that is a different dimension altogether. And what is happening with you right now, is entirely your making. From where you come from in India, is the only culture on the planet which constantly told you, your life is your karma. Karma means your doing. Your life is your making. Whatever may be happening, you may be able to logically figure out why it is so, you may not be able to figure out, but still you know one thing, if this is happening to me, this is my making. This is the greatest empowerment you can have when you understand my life is my making. Whatever happened till now, it doesn't matter. How will you make your tomorrow? I'm asking you. If you clearly, clearly know one hundred percent, my life is my making, how will you make the next moment? How will you make a tomorrow? How will you make your future in the most beautiful way? Isn't it so? That's what needs to happen.